First up, we're gonna take a ride on an iconic road to the 10th anniversary of the Bathurst Street and Custom Motorcycle Show. We're in McGrath's Hill, just near Windsor. Uh, we're meeting here today to go for a ride uh, out to the Bathurst Motorcycle Show. We've got an awesome day. The weather is perfect. Uh, not too hot, not too cold, and not wet. Uh, we've got a bunch of guys riding here, plenty of people to come on all sorts of bikes. Uh, we're heading straight over the mountains, over the Bells Line of Road. Now, if you haven't ridden the Bells Line of Road, it is a great, windy, twisty, free-flowing road, uh, and it should be a lot of fun. So, just gonna encourage everyone to ride at their own pace, enjoy the day, and get to the Baptist Show to see all the bikes. Looking forward to it. Oh, it's got some nice sweepers. Uh, coming over the top there is just absolutely brilliant. The cold air is, is awesome. Or you, even in summer, it's nice and cool, and that's what I like on a ride. Mate, today was one of those uh, perfect days. It was sunny, cool, tail into summer, open road. It was just yeah, fantastic. You, you certainly find the, uh, the the floorboards pretty quickly in some of the corners, but uh, yeah, no, really nice. A couple of years ago, we thought about you know get a mate of mine get up one end of Nasho, I'll get up the other end of Nasho and we'll just take some pictures, we'll come up with a nice good price that's fair for everyone and off we go. Um, three years later I've sold like 17,000 photos now which is pretty awesome. Um, we've donated over six, uh, $7,000 of um, income back to charities, the White Ribbon Ride, the Pink Ribbon Ride and anything like that, the, you know, the Black Dog Ride's coming up doing the same thing, we're auctioning a nice canvas that I put together when I went to the Isle of Man the photos I took there so you know I get to ride I get to take photos love it look we got through Richmond um, the two corners in Richmond were fine in fact out of the seven corners we uh, had to deal with we survived them all no dramas a good cruise a good bunch of guys it's quite nice being at the front although I think you put me at the front for a reason no one else wanted to wear fluoro did they I'm pretty sure about that no. so I was that guy wood duck like they call me yeah. We're at the Bathurst Street and Custom Motorcycle Show 2018 and uh, it's looking really good, the weather's perfect, the people are here and there's lots of chrome and bling. Behind us we've got 200 bikes, we've got the, the riders, they've got the families, they've got, you know, jumpy castle, there's kids with them. It's just a wonderful event and Bathurst is very proud to have it. This is the tenth time that the uh, Show and Shine event and your group of people have been up here. We're just so happy to have them. The streets closed off. We've done perfect weather. What more could you want? Primarily it's a bike show, so people have brought their bike to, uh, to put on display and we're going to judge it. There's a few different categories like best paint and best bike of show and yeah, a few other different categories. And so people have brought their bike to show off the things that they've done to their bike. So some people have uh, made some, some changes to their bike, they've heavily customised it. Other people have just kept their old bike going for many, many years. So it's something they love and they cherish and they pour their heart into. So people have come to show that off and other people have come to have a look at it. But of course we've got some trade displays up and down the street uh, selling things that re are related to motorcycling, clothing, some parts, other bits and pieces. We supply um, aftermarket Harley parts for um, like a wide range of the Harley Davidson uh, range. A lot of performance and um, stunt kind of parts like make your Harley handle and, and last. This is my uh, 2006 Harley Diner. Um, this is the first one that I built to um, wheelie and do stunts on. Pretty much every part on it come out of the States because it's hard to build a, a stunt ridden Harley Davidson here. I also now have got the 2018 Lowrider. Uh, it's the first Lowrider built in Australia and worldwide. I just had to get one and I had to be the first to do it. Thank you all for being here. Bathurst, of course, as you know, is the home of motorsport. Uh, the bikes of Easter were traditional so many years ago. Uh, I think 1989 was the last time that happened. That's nearly 30 years ago. That's hard to believe. No bikes at Mount Panorama at Easter time. But hold your horses, folks. The bikes will be back. Hursty started this show 10 years ago. Uh, it was really out of his passion to see motorcycles come back to, to Bathurst, uh, to motorcycle racing in particular, to come back to Bathurst. So he, it was the, one of the things that he could do to start lifting the profile of motorcycling in Bathurst. And 
Uh, that, I think, has been part of the new initiative for the, the, the local council to, uh, to start building a new racetrack for motorcycles. Watch this space. This time next year, hopefully we've got better news, or more news. I mean, this is great news. We'll have even better news for you next year. And the People's Choice Award presented by Aussie Bikers goes to entry number 39, owned by Kiwi Dave. It is the 2003 Harley-Davidson Softdale Deuce. Oh, yeah, it's quite a surprise. Yeah, especially this, you know, there's a lot of nice bikes out there. It's just been different, there's not many juices around anymore. And being a 100th anniversary, you know, they're getting quite rare out there. Now we come to the Greg Hurst Memorial Award. So the best bike in show is voted by our judges, goes to entry number 61, owned by Ian McKay, the uh, 2008 Custom Godfather. Well, Tangerine paint, uh, it's got a 127 cube engine, 300 rear tyre. Normally I get best custom out of it, but to win top of show, that's really put a highlight to my day.